Wow, look at this place. Oh, it's um, shimmering. It's like a, a force field or something. Wow, this train looks amazing. So well detailed. Hello? Hello, can you let me in? Oh, oh crikey, he made me jump. Hi guys, PD here, welcome to the channel, welcome to another new video. The developers of the VR game Abduction, and also the classic game Mist, have a new VR game in the works called Firmament. I have never played Abduction, so I'm going to try it out now, so come with me and let's dive in. Okay, here we are in the main menu. Right, I'm in space. Got some really cool asteroids floating around me. Now, I know Miss was a very demanding game, so I'm going to have a look at the settings. I don't know how this will perform on my 1060. Let's have a look at the graphics. Right, interesting. Auto detect has picked epic. Resolution scale, that was on 120. I'll put that down to 100. I clicked apply and it's gone to 99, so I'm going to leave that as it is for now. Controls. I'm playing on the Oculus with the touch controllers. It looks like you can play with the mouse and keyboard. Let's go back. Let's um, start a new game. Blink comfortable. Free intense. Yeah, I'll leave that as it is for now. I had a quick look at the game just to make sure it's performing okay. And it seemed fine, so... Okay, here we are, in the game. We're in some sort of clearing. Textures look amazing. Let's have a look at this tree. Wow, the trees look really realistic. We all lost everything. Everything but our stories. And they shouldn't be forgotten. I was three. It was April of 1983. Cecil, it was 1870 for you. Pam, Vera, you tell it like it was yesterday, but it's been 62 years since you saw that blast of light. No swimming. Okay, this looks amazing. The detail is incredible. We've got an old barbecue here. What's this say? Use only designated campfire pits. I can see a campfire over there. That's where all of our new stories began. It streaked across the sky, mesmerizing, but unnerving. Even in daylight, Joseph, you said it was gloriously bright. But in the twilight, it was spellbinding. Whether it was in the deep woods like Cecil, or right outside town like Jane and Jenny, we were drawn to see more. Vera, you said you were all smiling. Some of you were alone. I wasn't. My dear grandma, and bless her, rejoiced as if some forebearer of good fortune. Grandma lifted me from the carriage on the porch and walked into the yard so we could watch it unobstructed. Okay, I found a campfire. Well, I'm really impressed so far. I do have snap turning, so... Turn around. Fire's nice and warm. I'm going to follow the hiking trail. None of us understood. But, well... We followed. And we all 
all felt some kind of trepidation, and yet attraction as we approached and approached us. Okay, let's head towards the light. Wow. We should tell these stories because it, it saved us and Okay, that looks amazing. That was really magical. Oh. Okay, I'm in some sort of cave. There's the object right there. Okay, that's the object we've just seen. Can I pick this up? I can. Yeah, these textures are amazing. Detail is incredible. Okay, let's head onwards. The atmosphere is really amazing. Wow, look at that. Oh, that's cool. This looks like a cover from a sci-fi book, but it's all animated. I love the sensation you get from places like this in VR. This is just so magical. Okay, what's this? Welcome to Hunrath. I've got some weird device in front of me. It's running on a battery. And the battery goes to this button here, so let's press this button. Hello. Oh, hello. Bonjour. Ciao. Hola. Hello. Shora. Ni hao. Welcome to Hunrad. My name is Josef. I am the mayor here. You are most probably a bit confused and disoriented. But let me reassure you, everything will be fine. You're not the first to go through this experience. The others who have come before you will help you adjust. Follow the trail to the house with the white picket fence. Fali will meet you there and introduce you to your new life here. Okay, so we're looking for a house with a white picket fence. I can see a house over there in the distance. Wow. Games like this are like a dream come true. VR brings this all to life. These are the sort of places you dream about visiting and it feels like I'm here. I'm actually in this world and it's all real. If, you, if you've never experienced VR it's very hard to explain. I need to remember my sensor here.
the textures make everything look so realistic. Okay, looks like there's been children here playing. Very strange. It's like a house in the middle of nowhere. Is there anything in this uh, letterbox? Oh, found a letter to Caroline or whoever else might come back. It has been five days and not at all has returned. I am inclined to believe that things have not gone well. Yet surprisingly I am still alive and that both supremely perplexes me and gives me some portion of hope. I have retreated to my vault for protection and to contemplate my options. CW. Wow, look at this house. Okay, there's another button here. Farley's Community Centre. Let's press the button. Hello. Um, I'm Farley. Hello, Farley. I guess if you're seeing this, then I wasn't able to. Just in case, um, welcome, but it's probably not safe here. To be blunt, we're getting ready for a battle. I don't know what you'll find. I just thought I should, um, just be cautious with who you trust. CW may be here. I don't know. Just be careful. I've got to go. Okay. See you soon. And don't panic. As jarring as this experience is, you really will find Hunter at the be a decent place. If I hold my hand up to my face, this um, like camera icon appears. Uh, I'm gonna press the button, see what happens. Okay, I took a screenshot. Right, those holograms look really cool. Let's head into the house. Warning: Do not approach anything that even remotely resembles this diagram, unless it has been disabled. Very strange. I'm going to have a look around the house first. Can I lock in the windows? Nope, can't see inside there. That door's boarded up. Right, let's open the door, see what happens. Oh, is it locked? Okay, the door's locked. Let's have a look around the back. Right, the house is all boarded up. So there's no way to get into the house. Can I pull these planks off? Let me see if I can pull these off. No. Can I open a window? Nope. Okay, so... Time to explore, I guess. Let's have a look around here. Okay, it's just a dead end. Okay, so let's follow the train tracks. Which way shall I go? Left or right? I'm going to try left. Can I operate this? Okay, I can change the tracks. It's a very strange light laser shooting into the sky. 
Let's head this way. There's like a cave up here. Found some gravestones. I can't read that one. Benjamin Sims. Is that locked? So hard to know. Margaret Hartnell, Anna Jackson. I wonder if these are the children. I think this is another dead end. Some more graves up here. It's Carl. John. A lot of people died here. Wow, look at this place. Oh, it's um, shimmering. It's like a, a force field or something. It's a really cool effect. I want to make sure I don't miss anything. Some more graves here. These flowers look so realistic. Let's have a look in this um, tunnel. Another dead end. I heard like a frog or something then. Let's head towards this laser. Oh, that's a weird creature. Came out of this cave. It looks like at some stage I need to change these tracks. Okay, what we've got here. You can spend hours just exploring. Right, these are all boarded up. Right. So this is like a mining town. It's a very dark cave here. There's a boulder in the way. I'm looking for clues, anything of interest. It's on this table. Right, they've been playing blackjack. Let's have a look at this button. Downtown Unrath. Uh. We have a healthy, thriving community here, as you can see. Our garden was planted years ago and has supplied plenty of food for many generations. The buildings around town serve multiple purposes, including housing, schooling, 
and storage. I'm sure you have run across a number of folks already. No. Nope. Many were brought here, like you. And some actually were born here. We all feel we are part of the whole. I'm not seeing anybody yet. There's a note on here. Oh, it's another warning sign. There's something shimmering over there. Oh, these crops look dead. This place is very impressive. I am very impressed. Okay, what's this weird thing? Right, there's a laser there. I think that's dangerous. And there's a laser there. Okay, there's a laser pointing on the ground there and there's a laser pointing in the sky. I don't think it can go in there. Let me have a wander down this path. There's another button here. The waterfall. Part of our ecosystem here is our supply of water. It is supplied as a natural process of the system itself, and we don't really understand how. Although, the entire system is very closely tied together. The fact that one of the most important necessities of life has been provided to us has led many to believe that this place has a purpose. Others attribute a complex natural process, which we one day hope to understand. But either way, we are glad to have all the water we need. Okay, the waterfall is not working. I wonder if I need to fix that. Let's explore some more. There's another pulley here. This one is not attached to the railroad, so let's give this a pull. See what happens. The uh, water as well looks really realistic. Right, what did that do? Anything? All right, there's a pulley system. It's like a. Alright, so it's operating that. There a lot. Now the original game Mist was all about puzzles. Can I grab onto these? Oh! Okay. Try this one. Can't reach this one. Right, so is this like a, a lock? Let me give this a, a pull now. Okay, that's that's open. That's locked. So is there any way to keep this open? Very interesting. There's no hand holding in these types of games. You have to figure it out for yourself. 
Right, there's a, a door around there. Okay, can I go in here? There's no way to open this door. Oh. It's locked. Let's have a look through here. Can't see anything. Right, the waterfall doesn't work. Let's see what happens if I step into this laser. I can step past it actually. Right, there's a red button here. Let's go and press this red button. Nothing. Found some steps. Can I get around this way? There's one of them weird creatures again. Okay, this looks interesting. Guys, this atmosphere is incredible. What's this on here? Right, we've got some sort of metal door. Press all the buttons. Gobbled. Oh. Hello. Hello, can you let me in? Oh, oh crikey, you made me jump. Can you let me in? Okay, so it wants me to set up all the power lines. Are you going to let me in? Hello? Hello? He's gone. Okay, let's have a wander around again. like a lift over here I really wish I played this game earlier now I wish I played it last year when it first came out I think I missed a real treat here oh this is so cool okay up we go
Which way do we go? What's over here? There's like a door here. It's locked. Check out this laser. Right, can I move this laser? Can I try and get a good spot? I can't move it by hand. Let's head higher up. This view is incredible. I'm in heaven right now. Okay, so this is the waterfall. And it's blocked here, look. It's not working. So if I stand here, it's quite high up. The waterfall needs to go down there. So let's see if I can get this gate open. There's another pulley here. Right, let's give this a pull. There we go. That's the waterfall working. So I might be able to operate those. Wow, I can see all the train tracks going into the distance over there a lot. Right, that's the uh, waterfall working. There's a path here. See where this path heads to? Very mysterious. Is this an, another dead end? It is. Some weird device in there. I think those devices are causing this force field. Right, let's head back down. Right, that's not working now. That's a really cool effect. The uh, dripping water. I've got a feeling this lift does not work now. Oh, it still works. I'm just going to check to see if this guy will talk to me now. Now I've um, solved the waterfall problem. Hello? Are you in? Oh! Right, so I need to turn on some power. Right, so let's work this out logically. I've got the waterfall working. That's working.
Can I do anything with this now? Haha! -ha. Cool. I'm so clever. Okay, let's follow this path around here. I don't know where I'm going now. Got some giant butterflies. What we got down here? Someone's been camping here. We've got a hammock. Flask. Oh, very interesting. It looks like these bikes are used to power some sort of um, contraption above me. This is all very curious. Right, power cables. I found a yard full of trains. This looks like a power station. There's a big cable coming out of it. Radio fuel. Can I crank this? Give that a turn. That's pumping oil somewhere. Let's see where it's pumping the oil to. Find a pipeline. So this red pipe, which goes into this building here. Let's turn this on. Fuel drain. Fuel empty. So I need the fuel to go into here. What's this? Right. Prime start. That's primed it. Hold that down. I can hear it making a noise. There's no fuel coming in. Nothing's happening. What's that do? Can I turn it? Prime it. Then start. Nothing. Wow, this train looks amazing. So well detailed.
Well, I think there's plenty to do in this game. It's certainly a mystery. Just wandering around now. I'm trying to get to grips as to what I need to do. Okay, this is some sort of generator. Ah, so the generators, it looks like the generator might power the pump. So I think I need to get this working first. Let's have a wander up here. Okay, this is the other side of that um, where the greys were. Oh. Okay, what's this? There's no power, so it might not work. It's like an old um, typewriter. That's locked. So I need to power it up. And there's wires going up there. And outside. So I definitely need to power this place up. What's around here? Just gonna wander around here, then I'll call it quits on the video. I'm very impressed. I'm really itching to play this even more now. Right, is this another dead end? There's lots of these weird shapes here, look. Yeah, they must have something to do with the shield. Well, there's no smoking sign here. Flammable. Eric's town next left, Riggsville. Find an old telephone box. Can I get in here? Nothing happened. Okay, guys, I'm going to leave it there. Hope you enjoyed the video. This has been really, really interesting. It's an interesting building on top of that rock. I'm sure this is going to give me many hours of fun trying to work out all the puzzles. This world is so realistic. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye. It's a weird rock.